Hey, this is Beata from Simple Wholesome Living, and today I'm gonna to be sharing with you guys my favorite space saving storage hacks for our camper trailer or a tiny home or any small space. Okay, so for those of you who don't know, we downsized from a 1500 square foot home two months ago to this 300 square foot camper trailer. It is 30 feet long, it has two bump outs, it gives us enough space for what we need, and I didn't get rid of anything that I needed. I still have all of my kitchen stuff, I have an office in here, and all of my office supplies that I need. So it works for us, and I really believe it's because of these hacks. So let's get started. So in this frame, I actually have three hacks that I'm gonna share with you guys, these stools, that bench and these baskets. Okay, so first hack is our storage bench. This guy's pretty awesome. It actually tucks in underneath the shelf above and we have a wok, we have a pot, we have a crock pot, a toaster, a spiralizer, a KitchenAid mixer. This is where we keep our oven mitts and it's also where we keep our grocery bags. Okay, so this is our next hack. I actually had these as decor in our old home. There really wasn't much in them, but I used them to harvest vegetables all the time. And this was the perfect spot actually because back here, is this box we opened it up and we're like well that could be used as something but it can't be there's actually electrical wires back there so we can't use it so i was like oh well, i can put a plant there or i can put something useful there always choose something useful in a tiny home okay so this first one has our tupperware in it it's pretty empty right now we actually need to get new tupperware this next one has our uh, baking dishes and our baking Pyrex dish in here as well. So it's just great storage for um, things that we don't use every single day. And then in behind that tucks our protein powder. And I forgot to mention whenever I go to harvest vegetables, I just take what's in this top basket out and I put it on the bench here and then I go and harvest my vegetables, bring them back, wash them and put everything back in. Okay, next up are our storage stools. I looked long and wide for something with storage. I found them on Amazon. They are super cute. I love them and they operate as a stool or a little table. So you can flip it over, bring it over to the couch and put a little tea on it and it operates as storage. So we have a couple of baking dishes in here and our pie dish. And in this stool, we have our extra supplement storage. We do keep some supplements up in that basket there for everyday use, but these are our extras. Okay, so I'm pretty pumped about our couch because this is a huge space saving hack. This is actually something that comes out into a queen bed so that we can sit and enjoy movies together as a family and we pull it out and we just all relax but it also holds all of my storage for my office. Okay, so this is my little office space here. We actually took out an upper cabinet to make it possible. We are potentially gonna put a wood stove here for the winter and well, it'll be permanent. Um, and then we also have a little shelf here that works out nicely for some storage for essentials and then we actually took this part out it was just a flat wall and we found out that there was a little bit more space so we're going to build it out just like this one is built out there's just enough space to do the same thing in camper trailers there's always going to be space around the bump outs so this is the bump out or a tip out and there's always going to be space around the outside edges so we put in two wooden bins with uh bins inside of it for fruit and vegetables we have our water on top of there and we have a vertical hanging diffuser and if you don't have oils yet do me. That is another thing that I love sharing about all about natural living and those kind of things. This is our first bedroom storage hack. So this was actually completely covered up at the front. We had to lift the bed to get into it, which is fine, but it's a lot of work. So I took the front of it off and there was a lot of space in behind and I framed it out with these white pieces of wood. And then I bought these three baskets. And so the middle one is our sock hamper. So those are our clean socks and the outer two are the dirty laundry hampers. So my husband and I eat each have our own which is great so for the actual bedroom structure a closet on each side and the shelving unit above this was pretty much already here other than these were cabinets and we replaced it just for open shelving because I love open shelving so this was already built in they did a really great job with this but it's a great idea if so this isn't much of a storage hack this actually used to be a cabinet unit but I always find open shelving creates more space so we have everything that we need up here. We have an essential oil basket, plants, crystals. We have our favorite books on the shelf. The white basket has our tea cloths. The wicker basket has our supplements. We have our sourdough and our chaga. And for my daughter's bedroom, 
the bunk beds are definitely space saving hacks. And above we have put in some little shelves here where she can put some of her favorite books. And underneath we have her hampers here. We have some bookcase storage and some of her homeschooling stuff. So this is her little craft nook here and her huge cute window. She's definitely an artist. So having space for that was super important. And this is all built in, which is great. We didn't actually have to do anything, but it's lovely just having some baskets for her toys and for some homeschooling stuff. So for our kitchen, another hack was to actually take out the microwave and put up our air fryer there. We don't use the microwave for health reasons, but we can also put up some spices and oils there. And instead of a utensil drawer, we have this little cute utensil holder and that works out perfectly. And we can just grab spoons and forks whenever we need them. And then for our kitchen, I definitely recommend getting a nice big deep sink where you can put a dish strainer in there and that way you can do your dishes, you can let it strain out, let them air dry and then put them away because you're going to be doing a lot of dishes in a tiny home because things get messy real quick. So that is it for our camper trailer space storage hacks. I hope you enjoyed it. We definitely loved making all of these things fit our space and making storage kind of appear out of nowhere, especially with the couch hack from Ikea, by the way, and especially with our bench hack. So thank you so much for watching. Like and subscribe if this is what you're into and definitely follow along on Instagram and TikTok as well. Thanks so much, guys. Bye.